Hey YouTube, Natchez860. Not an O, a zero. Thank you. This is like take number five. All I can say is, thank goodness for video editing software. Smoking a Cuban cigar from my good friend, Dunk Pandy Boy Fuller. Got into a little trade. And I sent him some haunted bookshop. I hope he enjoys it as much as I'm enjoying this cigar. <clears throat> Gonna do something a little off the wall today. Gonna review a channel. Drew of the Shed. I was on the YouTube one Sunday night came across Drew of the Shed. Was curious. So I clicked on the video. Here sits a guy, average looking guy, in a shed. And he, uh, that was his introduction. And I think he had a little words of wisdom at the end of the video. And I wasn't quite sure what caught me, why I was so interested. The next Sunday night came around. Here comes Drew of the Shed. Decided I'd pay a little more attention this time. Attention to detail. So here you got this average guy wearing this flannel shirt. Working man shirt. He's in the shed with an extension cord hanging and maybe a rake and a broom or something. Makes you wonder where he's been. You know, the great thing about videos, television, your mind starts to fill in some of the blanks. You get the idea Drew might be a farmer or a guy who does a lot of work on his property. He's taking a little time out in his favorite spot in the shed. Maybe sitting on a keg of nails or something. A couple of bales of hay. You get to know Drew. Turns out, he comes from uh, a family where uh, agriculture was the occupation, I guess. And again, he has these words of wisdom as he's sitting there. Sometimes reads a quote to you. Remind me, reminded me of some dealings I had with farmers up in Maine. They won't say a word to you for hours. Then all of a sudden they'll come out with this earth-shattering bit of advice that you probably should be paying for. How to live your life. 
type of stuff. One video he talked about simplicity. And it was so funny because you look at the way he set up his channel, his video every week is from this simple shed. He's kind of a simple guy. He comes out with this this really mind shattering bits of wisdom. Stuff that makes you think. So, I really highly suggest when things are easy and quiet on a Sunday night, join Drew in the shed. You might learn some. One bit of advice to Drew, don't change your shirt. We know you do your laundry, you're a clean guy. The shirt goes with the shed, man. That's all I got for this week. Thanks an awful lot for joining me. Have a great weekend.